What is going on YouTube? Your boy Big C, True Gaming TV, and I decided that I was gonna, since I'm a huge Walking Dead fan, I decided that once a week I'm gonna try to bring y'all an episode of The Walking Dead the game. Now, season two, season one was just the way it ended pissed me off. I, I'm not gonna lie to you. Good game, but pissed me off. Season 2 jumped off decent. Very decent action, as you'll see. So, holla at your boy. Let me know what y'all think, alright? Don't forget to hit that like button, that sub button, alright, yo? Holla back. Peace. Previously on The Walking Dead. What's your name? I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. It's how the world works now! We are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it! Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Okay, you can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet. Clementine? Clementine! She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Lee, I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. I don't need it, Krista.
What do you think? Oh, Mead, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Why not? Because. Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Clementine, a little help here? Omid the second. No. What if it's a girl? Then we name her Krista. But I'm Krista. I don't want to call her Krista. That's just confusing. So name her Genevieve. I don't care. How can you not care? You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously, especially little Omid's future. Keep talking, and you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend? Why don't you, uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. Hello? safe to get cleaned up. I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. That's my gun. It's mine now. Give it back. Why should I? Get out here. You 
You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't gonna ask again. You don't have to do this. It's mean. You gotta be mean to keep going out here. I'm not mean. Yeah? And who got your gun? I'm serious. What else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me. I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around. Come on. I don't have anything. Give me that hat. No. Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. None of your business. Just give it to me. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Krista, talk to me. <sighs> this will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn more smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. It's okay. I can wait. <sighs> All we do is wait. And for what? You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... Omid said that- I know what Omid said. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. Can we make it that far? 
Maybe. I don't know. We just need to keep moving north. We sure as hell can't stay here. I miss Lee. I'm sure you do. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit.
still not enough. The flames are too low. This might burn. I'm by myself. Bullshit. He's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. She's not saying. What the Krista, fuck? Krista, run! Hey. Running! Quit squirming! Ow! 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 
Krista, are you there? It's okay, boy. It's okay. So, where are your owners? Are they around? If they are, I hope they're nice. What's he doing? What'd you find, boy? Where are you going? Wait up! Looks pretty run over, but you never know. Let's look around for some food. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. Hmm, nothing edible. Play? Want to play catch? Okay, bring it back. Good boy, good boy.
Well, here we go. Oh my god. Thank you. Look, a can! Now I just need... something to open it with. Boy, what's the matter? Shh, we have to be quiet. It's okay, he's dead. Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. We just have to stay out of their reach. <sighs> Still pretty sharp. Okay, well, now we're getting somewhere. Hmm. Please don't be bad. I guess you're pretty hungry, too. Here you go. 
Hey, you don't need it all. Here you go. Hey, you don't need it all.
on, kid. We gotta get it. I think... I think we're safe. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I... I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Well, I'm Luke, and this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! Ah! What? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. No, it really was a dog. Please, believe me. Look, I want to, kid, but I gotta believe my own two eyes first, and I didn't see no dog around. No, it was from before. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this? Now, what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You looked me in the eyes when you answered. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at. All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit. For all we know, she could be...
threatened with Parker. She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard that. You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> Uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it means saving her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos have a look first. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? Find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. Carlos, we've been through this before. We all agree. We don't wait for shit like this. End of story. <sighs> so, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. Well, we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by with it. please. But yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shed. It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry.
are we doing this? It's fucking dumb. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yes, safer. Ah. I can't believe this. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. He's got to have stuff for stitches. I think it's getting worse. It 
It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We are on the same page. Not out there, we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet in her? I want you to think about our family first. It's all I think about. So don't give me any shit. I need some air. House meeting in five minutes. Thanks. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Oh, fine. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Thank <laughs> you. 
You're not supposed to be in here. Hey, don't make a sound. I'm just trying to fix my arm. Well, um, what do you want? I need your help. My dad says I shouldn't talk to you. I'm gonna get in trouble. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it with, bandages, and I need to sew some of it up. It's too deep. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this supplies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super cool. Yes. We are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? I promise. Me too. Friends. A pinky swears forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Thanks, Sarah. Clean. I'll still need some bandages, though. That man sometimes. <laughs> need to have this baby. <laughs>
not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. This is gonna suck. <gasps> okay. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. Now the fun part. Krista showed me.
How did he get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? The shed should have been safe. Can I please come inside now? Please. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. Guys, please. You left me no choice. You could have just left. Relax, Rebecca. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurkers sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. I 
wish you wouldn't have done what you did. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. You don't have to threaten me. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else, that your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure, you are not to be trusted. Stay away from my daughter. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. Definitely. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for, well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were way out of line. You shouldn't have pointed that gun at me. I was hurt and needed help. And that's how you treat me? I was just... I know what you were trying to do, but that doesn't make it right. I could have died because of you. Whatever. Look, he means well. He just loses it sometimes. I try to avoid crazy people as much as possible. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. You can let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and, and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. 
He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone, but he saved me first, lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah, he was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? You're still here. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Whose baby is it? Excuse me? If it's not Alvin, whose is it? You shut your fucking mouth. Don't talk to me like that. Oh, what? You can't pull some shit on me. I'm not my husband. You should watch your language if you're going to be a you mom. You should watch your ass if you know what's good for you. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. You got what you came here for. Now go. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. She's all talk. She doesn't scare me. She was in a mood last night, that's for sure. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and... Then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey, why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And, of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I tried to apologize already. She ain't having it. Let's just get to the river. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. 
Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Think about it. Your Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. Can I help? I got it. Are you sure you're okay? Ask my uncle. He knows everything. I said I got it, okay? What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. I said I got it, okay? This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! Shouldn't we go get the others? Wish we could, but one of these folks might still be alive, and they just might be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You've gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. It's what I'd do. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good.
Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. That's my backpack. <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me. gonna do someone's outside someone came here looking for you a man what did he say what his name was we know damn well who it was who is he one of the guys we were with before what's he gonna do Can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. <laughs> 